Welcome. We're here at ALA 2012 in Anaheim with cartoonist Dave Roman. Welcome. Um, I have a couple of questions for you for our library audience. So what is it about your work that readers really respond to? I think that's for the readers to decide, don't you? Um, but I would think that the books that I do are very humorous and random, and I think that a book like Astronaut Academy is about sort of oddball kids. Um, so it's about a space hero named Hakata Soy who goes to a school that is a space station in the future and meets a lot of really weird kids and sort of gets sucked into their world and the sort of dramas and day-to-day -day politics of kids who are going through middle school experiences in outer space. And then my newest book is called Teen Boat, and that's about a boy who can transform into a small yacht. And I think kids respond to, one, they like the fact that there's transformation, so you've got a boy transforming into a boat, but they also kind of know that there's something kind of off about that as well, that boats are not exactly the coolest vehicle, but it's kind of fun, and I think kids like to imagine what and how that sort of transformation would take place, and, and maybe think of, random crazy ideas that they would want to pursue as comics as well. Now I noticed there's a second name on here, John Green. Um, so the book was illustrated and co-created um, with my longtime friend John Green, who is not John Green of Looking for Alaska um, and Nerdfighter fame, but John Green of Long Island fame and my fame because I've known him for years. We actually met while I was in high school and we both went to the School of Visual Arts together. Um, we were both students and a lot of the comics that we do either came from class projects uh, while we were in school or just funny ideas that came to us while we were traveling to conventions and shows. And Teen Boat actually started as a joke between the two of us on a bus ride, imagining what would be the craziest cartoon show to never have been created. So that was what's coming up. So what other, um, sorry, what, what other books would you recommend, or what books have you really liked reading recently? Um, I read a lot of graphic novels, and it's always hard to choose a favorite. Um, but one of my favorite graphic novels of all time is a book called Spiral Bound by Aaron Rainier, who is best known for doing a book called The Unsinkable Walker Bean. But uh, Spiral Bound was his earlier work, and it's in black and white, and it's about animals living in this town, and each one of them has like a really unique interest or identity thing, and there's a secret tunnel that leads to a secret society underneath the town, and I sort of equate it to like uh, Lemony Snicket meets uh, Richard Scarry's Busy Town. It's really cute and fun and lots of mystery and twists and turns. And 